Uh, the year 2013 was a very uh, um, remarkable, special and also painful year for the Clean Clothes campaign. As uh, many people know, on 24 April 2013 the Rana Plaza building collapsed and inside that building were four garment factories producing for many, many well-known high street names. And the Clean Clothes campaign had for years been uh, trying to get more attention and get improvements in the safety situation in Bangladesh. There have been many fires and also other building collapses. And when Rana happened and killed more than 1100 workers and injured for life uh, uh, over 2000, of course this, as I said, was very painful. It also uh, brought us the opportunity to finally push home our demands, which, as I said, have, we have been making for a long time. We campaigned very hard in the, in the weeks and months uh, after the collapse, together with the support of our colleagues of the Global Trade Unions, of many, many consumers in many countries, of civil society organizations in Europe and the US, and of course with our partners in Bangladesh. And as a result of that campaign, the Bangladesh Fire and Building Safety Accord got signed in May by the first uh, 30 companies and then later on by uh, uh, hundreds more. And under that accord, all uh, signatory companies have to ensure that their suppliers get an independent inspection and they also have to uh, participate in financially as well in the remediation. So we hope that after this now finally the necessary improvements in Bangladesh will be made. But of course there are uh, safety improvements needed also in other countries and many other issues that we continue to need to fight on. Workers still have no living wage, they, uh, their right to freely organize is being repressed and other trade union rights on a daily basis. We also are still struggling for the compensation of the Rana Plaza victims. And we hope you will work with us also in the coming years to realize those demands as well.